My name is Shanda Crosby, and I'm a psychic medium from Decatur, Illinois. Today we are at the Milton School in Alton, Illinois. We did the paranormal tour here last night. We first started out in the boiler room and I picked up a old man down there, probably around 50s, upper 50s. He was very on edge. It's like uh, he was really nervous to have people down there. I think there's been a lot of people going down there a lot and kind of being rude and taunting the spirits a lot. So he was on edge a lot. He didn't really like people down there. I believe he was a janitor here. Um, his energy was just the strongest. He, he loves this building. He's very protective of the building and I think that's why he gave off some kind of um, heavier energy because he, he doesn't, he's not negative, he doesn't want to hurt anybody, but he just wants to make sure that everybody respects the building because he loves this building and I think people have been here before doing tours that probably were disrespectful and he just felt like, I felt the walls that he tried to put up. But there's also um, a little boy down there, probably around eight years old. And he was, he was a really sweet little boy, but he was really scared for some reason. Um, I think this place has a lot of, a lot of history. It also has a lot of activity, like when it was open, there's a lot of actually imprinted energy in this building as well. Um, we went down in the basement there. I felt I picked up on a lot of dark energy down there. I don't know if someone had brought that energy in here, but I felt like a little darker and it was a lot heavier down there. Definitely had me feeling on edge. Um, the energy down there um, was darker, but I don't think that it has any kind of malicious intent. Um, usually the experiences here are, are positive. Um, most of the spirits here are little, little kids and children, and they like to tug on you um, or try to actually hold your hand when you're walking through. Um, a little girl grabbed my hand last night and tried to hold my hand when we were walking through. She's a, a really sweet little girl, and I think the boy that I came into contact with is her brother. Um, there was a, a story here of a janitor who um, raped and killed a little girl named Mary, and her body was found in the shower room. I tried to um, pick up on that. I did not pick up any energy like that at all. Um, I didn't feel any kind of um, murder or any kind of rape or anything negative like that that happened. Um, I also don't believe there's any record of that. I just do not believe that that story is true. I didn't feel that at all here. Overall, I think this building is, it's got a lot of activity. It's, it's got a lot of energy in it, a lot of imprinted energy, as well as a lot of spirits, um, mostly children, but there's a couple adults here. Most, all of the energy seems to be very uh, welcoming and positive. They just wanna make sure that people are respectful to the building. There was a little bit of darker energy downstairs, I think, that was brought to this building from humans. But that energy also would not harm anybody. It's just, it's just darker energy that might have been um, from the story of Mary being murdered, told over and over and over. 
that creates energy and it creates negative energy and it could have been what brought like the negative energy here.